reference. We were all in there. Especially All right. So you take Fox, your your controller, and Fox just slides in there. There you go. Now, if you press, have you have you played uh, Switch games before? No. Okay. So this, so if I say A, I mean that button. Right? So if you press A, switch start the game, and now let's go down and start a new game. So that you can is going to start up and while it's going you can uh, decide on which ship. So this is the ship that comes with Fox when you buy him. It's called an R-Wing. Um, articulate them like that if you want. So the, the ship would go on like this. The ship appears in the game, and then you can pick whichever weapons you like. So this is a flamethrower. These red ones have, are fire. These ones are ice. This is ice missiles. Um, it's called a hailstorm. This one shoots gravity missiles, um, and this one shoots a lift missile, and that's uh, just a gallon gun, a regular gun. So you can pick two weapons, one goes there and one goes there. Flame throw right now. There you go. Push it just like that. And then you push it on and it appears right in the game. There. Okay, so on that side. Yeah. Alright. And now if you hit the B button, you'll go into the game. She's not gonna make it. Get to the Equinox. We're coming. I'll man the bridge. Judge, take Mason with you to the hangar. We need to buy time for me to jumpstart the engine. Are you sure? Uh, I knew I should have retired back to the corner area.
how far we've taken this game from the, the original idea. Um, first new idea in the studio, such a, a big thing. And uh, I, uh, I'm totally want to say the words. I want to introduce the brain, the man, the person who has nurtured and built and developed this idea over the years. Uh, Matt Stone, uh, the entire team did a phenomenal job, but Matt Foley, it's like I, 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 <laughs> I bow. <laughs> um, congrats on everything, and um, and uh, Matt is the producer on Starlink, and he's gonna say a few words. so glad uh, that all of you could be here tonight uh, to help us celebrate the upcoming launch of Starlink Battle for Atlas. Uh, this is a pretty uh, special project for us. Uh, five years ago, uh, I had this amazing opportunity uh, to take a, a tiny team of, of, at the time, only eight people and try to come up with what the next new IP uh, could be, the first new IP from Ubisoft Toronto. And we did all sorts of crazy prototyping and crazy experiments uh, across all sorts of different technologies and different things. And, and one of those prototypes began with very humble origins. Uh, it was a Nintendo Wii remote, uh, and it was taped to a, a, like an Arduino, like a little consumer electronics board, and, and it kind of looked like a spaceship. And right from that first moment, you could see this magical moment in people's eyes when they connected a sort of spaceship looking part. We had limited resources. To a sort of spaceship looking home. And, and it would appear instantly in the game. And as rough as that initial prototype was, people started filling in all the missing pieces as soon as they saw it. And they started making their own sound effects. We've got this great video of someone from the studio, you know, doing this. <laughs> we had no sound effects. We had no sound design. OIJ was not on the team there. And they started, you know, inventing these dogfights against enemy ships and, and these adventures, dreaming these adventures that they could go on. And we knew at that moment that that, that was going to be the game that we were going to build here. And since then, uh, we have built the most amazing uh, game development team that I've had the pleasure of working with in my career uh, in game development. And I just want to give a huge, huge thanks to the team. Uh, many of whom are here tonight, and I've been helping you guys with a lot of people on our team has just bought, brought something so special and so personal and such passion and dedication uh, that's made the game what it is today. And you know, while our team started here in Toronto, and, and we've had the uh, privilege of working with so many amazing partners in Ontario and, and in the city, um, you know, the, the actors, uh, again, a few of you are here tonight, and, and uh, you know, Trevor, who made all the music for the game, and, and working with Elliot and all these groups in, in Toronto, but, you know, as this team grew and as this project, you know, as our ambition grew, uh, it became truly international. And we actually have a very, very special uh, guest, or very special guests, who have come all the way uh, from China uh, today to visit us today um, uh, from our manufacturing partners in China. Uh, and uh, they brought us this box, which is the very first off the production line starter pack. Of 